within the extruded boss space option as well as several of the other tools here including the revolve sweep and loft you can create what's known as a thin feature using an open profile so typically when we drop a sketch for example on the front plane we create a closed entity and then create an extrusion from this but we can also create open geometry for example if I change this to a construction geometry now I have an open sketch and if I come into the extrude boss base it's now going to automatically check this option called thin feature and this works just like any other extrusion except now I have a few more options I can choose a mid-plane thin extrusion two direction so I can control the thickness on the inside as well as on the outside of this line and you can also auto fill it any corners that you have in the sketch just keep in mind with the auto fill it option that it won't show up in the preview but once you click OK you'll see those fillets added in with the extruded thin option you can use pretty much any geometry if we wanted to create a spline for example we can come in and also use that extruded thin option and this is overall a quick way to create an extrusion without having to create an entire closed geometry lastly I can also create cuts using the extruded thin and I can also create extruded thins from closed profiles so if I create a new sketch and use a closed profile and create an extrusion. I can choose that thin feature. And have this shelled out part. And once again I can also create an extruded thin cut. Which will generally result in multiple bodies depending on how you create the cut. 